Why do cats love kneading? Is it something they learned as kittens, or does it actually go back to their wild ancestors? And can too much kneading be a sign of a health problem? In this video, we're going to look at the real reasons why cats need, so stay tuned, because there's more to this mystery than meets the eye. First, what is this kneading phenomenon? The term kneading comes from the motion's resemblance to kneading dough. To us, this kneading behavior might seem quite funny or strange. But here's an astonishing fact, cats knead in rhythm, often at a pace that's almost identical to the rhythm of a relaxed human heartbeat. It's as if they've picked up on our calming cues and found their unique way of syncing with us. The root of the habit. Let's journey back to when your cat was just a tiny kitten. This behavior isn't something they pick up from us or their environment. It's ingrained. Kittens need their mother's belly to stimulate milk production. It's one of their earliest learned behaviors, with the majority of kittens starting this as early as less than a week old. But why do they continue kneading into adulthood? Like us, cats need their comfort routines. Kneading for them is a soothing activity, similar to how a child might find comfort in holding onto a blanket or a favorite stuffed toy. When your cat needs, they're not just settling into their favorite spot on the couch. They're setting into a rhythm of relaxation, a routine that's familiar, comforting, and utterly blissful. The scientific explanation. Did you know that kneading isn't just about comfort? Each time your cat needs, they're leaving a little bit of themselves behind, quite literally. Cats have scent glands in their paw pads that release their unique scent onto the kneaded surface, effectively marking it as their territory. Did you know that cat scent markers are as unique as human fingerprints? Each kitty has its own signature scent, making the common spots of kneading around the house their unique domain. But the plot thickens. Kneading could also be an echo from the past, a habit passed down from their wild ancestors. Long before our domesticated cats curled up on our laps, their ancestors in the wild would tread down tall grass or foliage to create a safe and cozy place for sleeping or giving birth. Not just that, kneading also helped uncover hiding prey in these grassy habitats. Kneading and your cat's health. Can too much kneading be a sign of something off with your cat's health? Scientific research has shed some light on this, showing that excessive kneading could be a sign of dehydration in cats. It's their way of saying, I'm not feeling my best. When a cat is dehydrated, their skin loses elasticity, causing them discomfort. Kneading helps them manage this discomfort, much like how we might crack our necks or stretch when we're feeling off. We all know cats are smart. But do we really give them enough credit? Check out this video, where we talk about 10 secrets cats know about their owners. And be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline-loving community.